With the right investment in the agriculture sector, Zambia has the potential to become a leading producer of edible oils. Zambia currently has 800,000 metric tons crushing capacity and 300,000 metric tons refinery capacity in the production of edible oils. Paragate Group of Companies and Export Trading Group have invested 35 million United States dollars to revamp Zamanita cooking oil plant. Republican President Edgar Lungu relaunched the plant and went on a familiarization tour. Speaking after the tour, President Lungu says the plant will help to boost Zambia's non traditional exports. The relaunch of Zamanita plant presents us with a great opportunity for Zambia to increase our non traditional exports, particularly that oil cake and other solid residues of soya beans are already among the major non traditional exports. In that regard, I wish to encourage the group to continue working with our people, especially in rural areas, by providing ready markets for farmers' produce. Thus, according to the group's principle of enriching and empowering communities. And Expo Trading Group Chief Executive Officer Burju Patel has pledged to work with Zambian farmers. We believe in agriculture and the associated supply chain. ETG Paragate's dedication to the Zambian farming community remains unhindered. The group is trying to create a sustainable value chain directly aimed at uplifting the lives of the country's smallholder farmers. Zambia has a soya bean production capacity of 260,000 metric tons with consumption capacity of 150,000 metric tons. Agriculture Minister Michael Katambo says the plan to provide a ready market for soya beans and enhance production. We are very happy with the commissioning of this project as it is a big opportunity for the local oil seeds industry and in particular for stimulating soya beans, sunflower and cotton production in the country. The launch of the Manita plant is very timely as the production of oil seeds in Zambia has not performed very well in recent years. Over 50,000 small-scale farmers will benefit from this plant, including those in areas such as Chongwe. Diamond TV News, Wenson Mavora.